south here on the back deck, and I just want to uh, show you a, a bit of a mystery we had uh, just the other day. It's a shame I didn't think of doing this sooner, but it was kind of dark last night, and it would have been hard to get the, um, the uh, well, the photos to you in a proper manner. Uh, also, uh, well, I did, we didn't know quite what to make of it, but the case is solved. Uh, Sandy, I, I come walking in last night from work, and Sandy said, you know, there was, last night, there was a bear on the back deck. Now, this is our back deck, as you see, and frankly, the only way a bear could get in here would be to climb up a tree and down a limb, maybe, or uh, perhaps uh, open up the gate. But I, I said, Sandy, I don't think we, we really have a problem with a bear back here, do we? And she says, well, there's footprints. You should see the, uh, there's tracks. And she says, I don't know how they, how they, uh, how they got, how the bear got up here, but there's tracks. And so she, I said, well, let's go see the tracks. And she showed me, well, here's what's left of one. This is about the only one. See it right there? In the snow, there was a pattern of these, these uh, rows of holes in the snow. I think it was four, and then another, and another, and another, and another. And I said, my God. And I said, the only thing is, Sandy, I don't see where the doggone... You know, bears have claws, and also they're asleep this time of year, but they they have claws, and usually there's a claw print. I said, I don't know how many uh, toes necessarily a bear has, but, and uh, I wish I had more to show you here, friends. Now, this, if you could see this in a proper angle right here, there's, there is actually uh, indentations. One, two, three, and I think a fourth one there. And then, uh, and it, it would, it continued right up to the, uh, to the railing. And I said, my gosh, this is, uh, this is interesting, but I don't see. And of course I'm sitting there thinking, my God, how did, what are we going to do? A bear gets up on the back deck. How do we get rid of it? You know, I mean, who's going to go, well, yeah. <laughs> it probably won't be me and it probably won't be, I don't know what the heck we'd do. I guess just make a lot of noise and maybe the bear would knock down the wall and <laughs> take a leap. Well, you know what it turned out being? All of a sudden it hit me. I'm sitting there eating my supper, kind of looking over my shoulder, waiting for a Bruin to come crashing through the front door. I said, wait a minute, it's me. She says, that's not, she says, first off, she says, what are you doing walking out in the snow uh, in barefoot? I said, I did. I did, I forgot. There was something I wanted to see over the railing, and I, I didn't feel like putting my shoes on. And I said, well, it's not that awful cold out. I'll just go. That's my footprint. <laughs> That's my toe. Big toe, little, uh, the, the, the next toe over, and uh, yeah, this is all on my uh, left foot, and it probably went out to about here. And then if you could see it, there would have been, I think it's, it's dissolved, but there was one here and one there, and I worked my way through the doggone snow. So anyway, case closed. <laughs> I will say we do have coyote prints. I don't know if I can, I don't know if we can see them. It had the birds a little, a little upset. Let me see if I see them out there. I don't think I do. But we did evidently have a coyote meandering around. Uh, the neighbor's dog wouldn't come out on a day, on days like we've had uh, lately. I don't see anything else. I guess we're okay. But, man, that bear. About the only thing else we got up here on the deck is some of the birds from the, uh, from the, feeding, uh, from the feeding area down below on the ground. Some birds have come up thinking, well, maybe they could uh, talk Sandy into uh, maybe dropping a uh, a few seeds up here for them, you know, they, they're they willing to pay, you know, pay more for the, uh, for the privilege. Yes. So we do have some, <laughs> actually, I see Sandy did that. See, that's all bird seed. And so the birds did come up and have a little, a private, uh, I guess a private balcony setting. 
That way they didn't have to be. Look at the mess those birds have made of the snow. Oh my gosh, can you see it? Yeah, what's those odd foot? Well, that's me. I was walking around trying to uh, make the uh, snow a little tighter on where the birds eat the seed. And and you can see one one footprint all the way off to the left. Uh, that's where I slipped and almost started going down the uh, down the hill towards the river. Luckily, uh, luckily I caught myself. But anyway, there you go. I just thought I'd point all that out for you, friends. God bless, and uh, well, have a good day. <laughs> and feel good to knowing there's no bears, at least at the moment, on Ruth Lane. Uh, not at the moment. We'll see you later. God bless.